Hello everyone, welcome to Yellow Pages Nursing. In today's video, we will be discussing about drug calculation, how we convert milli unit per minute to milliliter per hour. Before entering into the session, if you have not subscribed our channel, please subscribe our channel and do not forget to hit the bell icon to receive instant notifications. Let's get into the topic. Now using the formula method, let's discuss the first example. Doctor's order reads oxytocin drip 1 milli unit per minute. Supply 10 units oxytocin in 1000 ml NS using infusion pump. Calculate the rate of infusion ml per hour. The formula is desired dose multiplied by quantity multiplied by time divided by available dose multiplied by 1000 equal to x. Here the desired dose is 1 milli unit. Quantity will be 1000 ml. Available dose is 10 units and time will be 60 minutes. We need ml per hour to set for the infusion pump. So in order to convert the 1 milli unit per minute to 1 milli unit per hour, we need to multiply 1 by 60. So applying all in the formula, we get 1 multiplied by 60 multiplied by 1000 divided by 10 multiplied by 1000 which gives 6 and hence we set 6 ml per hour. The point to remember here is 1 unit is equal to 1000 milli units. Here available dose is in units and the doctor's order is in milli units and hence in order to convert the units to milli units we multiply the denominator by 1000. Hence we set 6 ml per hour in the infusion pump. Let's move to the next example. Doctor's order reads oxytocin drip 0.5 milli unit per minute. Supply. 10 units oxytocin in 1000 ml NS using infusion pump. Calculate the rate of infusion that is ml per hour. The formula is desired dose multiplied by quantity multiplied by time divided by available dose multiplied by 1000 equal to x. Here the desired dose is 0.5 milli unit quantity is 1000 ml. Available dose is 10 units and time will be 60 minutes. Remember 1 unit is equal to 1000 milli units. Applying all in the formula, we get 0 0.5 multiplied by 60 multiplied by 1000 divided by 10 multiplied by 1000 which gives 3 and hence we set 3 ml per hour in the infusion pump. Now for your practice, doctor's order reads oxytocin drip 1.5 milli unit per minute. Supply 10 units oxytocin in 1000 ml NS using infusion pump. Calculate the rate of infusion ml per hour. You can do the calculation and mention the answer in the comment box. Here you go with the drug calculation of how we convert milli unit per minute to ml per hour. If you find this video useful, please like it, share it and subscribe it and do not forget to hit the bell icon to receive instant notifications. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day.